Here we see a robot that can see two April tags. The April tags are really noisy. This is what's causing all these red specks uh, with these little pink traces around. The farther away we are from an April tag, the less likely it is that we'll see it, which is causing it to flicker. And the more noise that April tag will cause. So that's what these very wide spaces on the pink dots is. Uh, the robot will occasionally gets bumped every now and then by another robot that we can't see. So the green, ta green line is uh, keeping track of where we think the robot is based on its velocity. And our velocity isn't quite perfect, so you can see it's wandering around there even though the robot's staying still other than getting hit by a little bit. But as we move around, after we've been bumped a couple of times, we can see that the robot uh, that, you know, just straight velocity-based position can get very far off with the bump. But as soon as we can see a little bit of an April tag, it pulls, even as noisy as this April tag is, it's starting to pull the position towards the average of those. And as the April tags get better and better, uh, as we're closer and closer and the data we're getting is better and better, you can see that the green dots are really centered quite well uh, along with where the robot is. Just drive around here for a little bit. So now, oh, as soon as we saw a couple April tags, it pulled that lagging position off. Here, these big jumps are where just the few sites of the April tag pulled that very incorrect position in. Uh, and the noise that I have here on our positions is very likely higher than what we'll really experience. Uh, but I'm trying to account for really a worst case scenario and just see if this is good enough. So as long as the, let's wait for this, there you go. As long as our green bluish uh, is pretty close to where the center of the actual robot is, then we've got a really good estimate to work with. This implies that if we if we care about keeping our uh, localization correct, we don't want to drive across the field not looking at anything, uh, but instead should come over and try and see if we can keep April tags in our sight while we're driving, just so that it takes a little bit less time for us to get close.